And it was family weekend at Johnny United Stadium, but the Columbia Lions were ready to rain on the Tigers parade. And that's not really foreshadowing. It was pouring out in this game as the punt from Bill Sears goes deep in the Lion territory, but through the hands of one of the Lions and into the hands of the Tigers. Blakey recovers the fumble, and, well, the game had to stop right there. I guess enough was enough. Too much rain, some thunder, some lightning. Things had to be called and calm down for a moment, but the Tigers would get right back to it. How about Schaefer handing off to Matt Caster, a positive running play for the Tigers, and Caster is in the end zone for his first rushing touchdown of the game and of the season, for that matter. Seven to nothing, the Tigers on top of Columbia, and of course that would cause some dancing and a lot of a lot of rain coming down here, but it would not stop the Tigers and. It would not keep them from doing what they needed to do. But Columbia, the Lions roaring back in this one as he catches the ball. And he is to the hazy to the house for the Lions. And it's touchdown Columbia. 7-7. Seven to seven, We're all knotted. And, well, Towson, you got to start worrying a little bit here. You're letting some Ivy Leaguers tie the game up at 7-7, seven, seven, which is 9.32 to go. And this isn't mad. This football, ladies and gentlemen. And Hakeem Moore would remind us of that. How about he catches the kickoff? And he splits the defense down the left sideline, and he is to the 50, the 40, and out of bounds around the 35-yard line. And just like that, the Towson Tigers set up in perfect field goal range for Mark Benzavingo. He kicks it right up through the middle of the uprights. The kick is good. And then on the next possession, Towson, Sean Schaefer finds Marcus Lee in the left corner. That's his third touchdown, or actually third game this season with a touchdown. And Towson on top, 17-7. 18 seconds to go in the half. But we go to the third quarter where there was a little bit more drama. How about the field goal from Columbia? 17-10, only down a touchdown, and, well, they knew exactly what to do with it after that, getting the ball inside the 10 deep in the Tiger territory. And then how about Columbia one more time, going to tie this game up, stepping up into the pocket, and then finding the open receiver in the back of the end zone, touchdown, and we're all knotted once again here at 17 apiece. And, well, we had ourselves a dogfight. It was the sun wasn't quite shining on either one of these teams defensively, but Towson, again with a touchdown to West White, his first career catch and his first career touchdown, and what a time and what a way to get it. 24-17, under a minute to go in the third quarter. Let's go to the fourth quarter. Columbia trying to come bouncing back into this game, and they say, hey, we might be Ivy Leaguers, but we're going to find a way to make it happen. How about diving into the end zone, loses the ball, but he was in the end zone first. Touchdown, Columbia, 24-24. How about a game-winning drive now for Towson? Sean Schaefer has ice water in his veins. There was plenty of water on the field, but Hakeem Moore says, hey, we don't need any of that. We've got speed. How about Moore breaking it to the left and then back up the same sideline as before deep in the Columbia territory? Then Schaefer, knowing what to do with it, he knows what to do in these situations. He's used to it. Schaefer rolling right deep over the middle of the field to the X Factor. Steve Holmes with the catch, and then here's Schaefer again. And Schaefer would find John Galoski. Get off me, little man, as he pounds his way into the five-yard line. Game-winning touchdown time. And how about Matt Caster, his second touchdown of the day, rumbling, stumbling into the end zone. And Towson would go on top and end up winning the game 31-24. Can you cut out that ball? 